Buenas noches. Este es el Programa Nacional de Inglés para el Trabajo, modalidad online. Beginners 3. Welcome to your English class. Today is Friday, the septem September the 9th. This is class 5. Today we're going to study unit review, review and practice. The general objective is participants will develop competencies that will allow them to express orally and in written form elements of the identity of the company they work for, socialize in business and work settings, discuss communication and etiquette, standards at work, and make business travel plans. Specific objectives. Students will, will review the competencies learned in Unit 1 to talk about the structure of a company, and how various departments relate to each other. Class objective, students will work in groups to structure a company and complain how, sorry, and explain how different departments relate to each other. <clears throat> the agenda for tonight is going to be discussing a good friend, core values, the crossword, the structure of the company, and the report. This is the review for unit one. On Monday, we start unit two. So, we're going to start uh, with a good friend, warm up, a good friend. But before we actually, sorry, we actually start reading, we're going to go to the attendance. Abigail Mejia Mendoza, Ana Maria Portillo, Andrea Amalia Garcia, Andrea Maria Cruz, Dilcia Yamile Fernández, Emma Gloria Martínez, Esmeralda del Carmen Ayala, Gabriela Beatriz Moreno, Jorge Antonio Sánchez Quiñones, José Ezequiel Guzmán, Juan José Herrera, Kenya Elizabeth Rodríguez, Lady Xiomara Chicas, Maritza Yanir Hernández. Present teacher. Excellent. Paola Stephan Stephanie Mejía. Paola. Okay. Raquel Abigail García. Present. Excellent. Nice. Raquel Beatriz Segura. Rebeca Guadalupe Aguillón, Sandra Patricia Ramos, Stephanie Michelle Oviedo, Guadalupe del Carmen Silva, Mauricio Antonio Velázquez. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. And Jonathan Alexis Alfaro. Okay, let's begin. Okay, let's begin with the warm up. A good friend. A good friend. Okay, so we're going to practice reading this one. First, uh, I'm going to read it for you. <clears throat> Later, you can read it on your own with your partners. Okay. Let's see. The purpose is to discuss a good friend. What are the qualities of a good friend? You probably had a lot of amazing and not so amazing friends over the years. Knowing that, knowing what made the great ones stand out from the rest can help you choose the right friends going forward. Friends 
make life more meaningful and are good for our health. Great friends offer emotional support and make us feel loved and connected. These are critical elements of our mental and social well-being. That's why it's so important to choose our friends wisely and treat them well. However, sometimes finding or even being a good friend can get tough. For many people, making friends as an adult already feels harder. We often don't know what friendship will bloom. We have so many casual acquaintances to nurture, but only so much time and energy. Okay, life is busy and humans are easily distracted. In these moments though, knowing the qualities of a good friend is even more important. We need support the most when work is stressful or personal problems are weighing on us or weigh, weighing us down. Okay, that would be the introduction. Okay, then we have the discussion. The discussion says, discuss the following questions. What's friendship? How many good friends you have? Is how many good friends do you have? Here I ate the do. What qualities does a good friend have? Do you have the same qualities? Why is it important to be a good friend? Why is it necessary to have good friends? Okay, these are the questions. Okay, so the reading and the questions. For the moment, that's what we will practice. Okay, so let's begin. I'm going to go and make the groups, maybe two groups, three groups. Let's see how many people are present. 13, okay? So 12 people, three groups. Okay. Let's make three groups. Permissions for everybody. Three groups. All right, the groups are, are open, so please join. Okay, in group one, we are missing an Andrea Amalia Garcia, Jorge Antonio Sanchez, and Lex, and Lady Xiomara Chicas. We only have Maritza. Okay, now we have more. Okay, now in three. Yeah, okay, everybody. Only Andrea is not connecting. Okay. Hello. Hello. Good night. Good night. Good night. Yeah. Lady. Marixa. Marixa. Hello, hello. Okay. Andrea. Hola. Okay, podemos empezar entonces. Bueno. Eh, la primera pre pregunta. La, la primera pregunta es what friendship what friendship lady este bueno para mí es como no sé decir español <ríe> eh, es un sentimiento que se siente Valga la redundancia. ¿En inglés? No, no sé cómo se dice sentimiento en inglés. Feeling. It's a feeling. A feeling. Feeling. It's a feeling. Um, 
and the other person. Okay. Externals and the family. Okay. Marixa. Creo que son las preguntas, las preguntas del, del texto de arriba. Mm -hmm. The questions are disconnected from the text. Uh -huh. Ah, bye. Okay, the text is one thing and the questions are different. First you read, then you ask, but disconnected. The questions are not about the text. Okay. Vaya. Dice. Pueden compartir pantalla. Tienen permiso. Alguien puede compartir. Excellent. Thanks. Ahí está alguien ya compartiendo. What's friendship? Uh, friendship. Do many activities with this person. And you know that this person always be there when do you need something. The question number two, uh, how many good friends you have? Um, veo que está Andrea. No sé si iba a comentar algo. Es que le estuve preguntando, pero no me contestó. Um, bye. Uh, how many good friends you have? Hmm. Good friends? Only two. And you, Esmeralda? Se nos perdió Esmeralda. In my case, I have... Um, Five good friends. Uh, we are a group. Um, when we can, we um, we go out together. Um, we always we have a group in WhatsApp, and we always have communication too. The question number three: What qualities does a good friend have, Rebecca? And um, honestly. It's uh, honestly with me and it reciprocal. No sé cómo se dice. And reciprocal. 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 And it's for me in the good, in the about time and you know, a person, uh, a people that I always uh, con la que siempre puedo contar. I a person I can depend on always support me. Podría ser siempre apoya. Always support. In my case, uh, the qualities, qualities are respect. Two good okay. friends. Hey, lady. And you, lady. And I have two. Okay. For me, I have uh, three friends. This is this is question. What quality does a good friend have? Mm. 
dice what quality does a company. Dice qué cualidades debe tener un buen amigo. Sí, para mí, por, eh, eh, por honesty. Exacto. Honesty. Eh, empatía. Eh, empatía. Eh. Leal. Eh. Funny. <risa> <risa> ok. okay. Funny. Aunque yo soy la enojada del grupo. <risa> Leal. Eh. Eh, Leal. 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 Eh, honesty. Loyal. Honesty. Ro loyal. Right. Okay. Eh, teacher, sincero, ¿cómo se dice? Sincere. 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 Ah, sincere. sincere. Okay. Eh, the fourth question. Do you have the same quality? ¿Qué significa? Eh, que, que si nosotros tenemos las mismas cualidades, pienso yo. ¿Y tú yes. you have? ¿Tú tienes las mismas cualidades que has mencionado? Yes. Ok. Yes. Ok. Andrea Amalia. No, Lady. Yes. Yeah. Abigail. Yes. Marixa. Uh, yes. Ok. The five question is. Why is it important to be a good friend? Dice, ¿por qué es importante ser un buen amigo? You lady? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mm, yes, I have. Mm, sometimes. <laughs> Why is it important to be a good friend? Eh, because. Because you can. Yeah. Have a good Gabi. <laughs> Ay, es cierto. <laughs> no me acordaba que les estoy compartiendo pantalla. <laughs> y, nos aparece, y nos aparece otro chat. <laughs> no me acuerdo cómo me meto. Oh, me meto de vuelta aquí. Mm, cierre, lo creo que tiene que cerrar él. Solo dale clic a la otra pestaña. ¿A dónde? A la pestaña de la presentación. Aquí, al, la tercera pestaña. Ay, qué... Ay Gaby, ya te digo el WhatsApp. La que dice presentación. <risa> la que dice presentación. La que está a la par de WhatsApp. Ah, <laughs> ok. <laughs> Tengo una llamada. A ver la <laughs> última. Why, why is it is ne necessary to have good friends? Ya vengo, ya vengo.
que eh, don't be friends, we are family. Eh, y yo pienso que es verdad, porque nosotros we are, eh, somos bien unidos. Ajá, join. Sí. Eh, question, pues, ah, Juan José, hello. Pues la hola, 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 hola. We are answering the question and for you, what friendship? What friendship? Uh, ¿Qué es friendship? Amistad. Amistad, ¿qué es la amistad? Ok. Tenemos que responder esto, formular una respuesta en inglés, me imagino. <ríe> yes. Ok. Friendship. What is, what is friendship for you? It's a relationship. Um, between two or more persons people between, between two persons that they have respect they have um, uh, good times they have uh, common things o sea, cosas en común yeah and confianza, no sé cómo decirlo, porque una buena amistad está basado en, en la confianza. Confidence. Trustly, trustly. Confidence. Confidence. Okay. Confidence. Oh. Confidence. Ok. Ok, question number two es... Soy la okay, que yo... Ah. Ok. Prosiga. Aunque Acabo sea para... De ingresar. Acabo ah. de ingresar y, y no sé qué están haciendo exactamente. Pero... Fíjese que ahorita ya contestamos las preguntas, solamente estamos eh, repasando las preguntas, o sea, como le digo, eh, leyéndolas de nuevo para que repasemos aunque sea el vocabulario, porque ya las respondimos todas. Ah, en todo okay. caso, si, que, si gusta, le pregunto yo a usted. O quiere leer nada más. Ahorita. No le escucho. No se escuchó. Uh -huh. Ok. Okay, let's see. Now, uh, nobody wanted to read. So people went to the questions and they ignored the reading. <laughs> okay. Well, let's continue then. Uh, now we have a conversation. This is a conversation between Jesse and Johnny. Okay. Over here, you see, in the picture, you see a meeting of good friends. They are different, but they are good friends. Okay. You don't have to be equal. You don't have to be the same uh, in all respects to have fun with your friends. What you need is respect, tolerance, patience, sincerity, and honesty, okay, in a relationship, right? So let's see. Hey, Johnny, 
Do you have good friends? I do, but not many. Maybe two or three. Why? I was just wondering, do you count me among your good friends? To be honest, I hadn't considered the idea. I hadn't considered it, no había considerado. I hadn't considered the idea, but I suppose so. What qualities do you think are important? That's easy. Honesty, sincerity, loyalty, and confidentiality. Is gender important? Gender is género, no sexo. Género, sexo es una actividad y gender, y gender es un género. Okay, so we have more like, in passport dice sex, pero tendría que decir gender. Okay, gender. So is gender important? Yes, it is. But it isn't determining. It isn't determining. It isn't determining. You're a girl and you're my friend. And I never have problems with you, right? No, you don't. I consider you my best friend. I can trust you. Oh, that's corny, you know. Peter, what's corny? Corny is eh, cuando es romántico pero muy dulzón. What do you say? Meloso. Cursi. Cursi. <laughs> Cursi, uh -huh. cursi, that's corny, you know, it's cursi, mm -hmm. cursi, yeah, it's cursi, okay, corny, uh -huh. it's dulzón, cursi, 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 okay, so, hey, Johnny, you have good friends? I do, but not many, maybe two or three, why? I was just wondering. Do you count me among your good friends? To be honest, I hadn't considered the idea, but I suppose so. What qualities do you think are important? That's easy. Honesty, sincerity, loyalty, and confidentiality. Is gender important? Yes, it is, but it isn't determining. You're a girl and you're my friend and I never have problems with you, right? No, you don't. I consider you my best friend. I can trust you. Oh, that's corny. Okay, so this is the conversation and we're going to practice it again in the groups, okay? So let's go to the groups. I'm going to recreate the group. Let me see how many people we are. We're 19, okay. 19 people. So, 19, how many groups? With four, I made 16 people. Maybe five groups. That would be four groups of four and one group of three, okay? Uh-huh, let's see. The groups are opening, please join. Okay. El teacher faltaba, eh. 
<risa> ok, ¿quién comienza? Ok, voy a ser Jesse. ¿Quién sería Johnny? Yo. Ok. Hey Johnny, do you have good friends? I do, but not many. Maybe two and three. Why? I was just wondering, do you count me among your good friends? To be honest, honestly, I hadn't considered that I, the idea, but I suppose so. What qualities do you think are important? That's easy. Honesty, sincerity, loyalty, and confidentiality. Is gender important? Yes, it is. But it isn't determined. You're a girl and you are my best, my friend. And I never have problem with you, right? No, you don't. I consider you my best friend. I can trust you. Oh, that's corny. You know. <laughs> okay. Next. Alguien que quiera participar conmigo. Me. Si quieres sea usted Jesse y yo Johnny. Vaya. Hey Johnny, do you have good friends? I do, but not but but not many. Maybe two or three. Why? I was you water what the right. Do you count me among your good friends? To be honest, I had I hadn't considered the idea, but I suppose so. What qualities do you think are important? That's easy. Honestly, sincerely, sincerely loyalty, and confidentiality. <laughs> is gender import? Yes, it is, but it isn't determining. You are a girl and you are my friend. And I never had problems with you, right? No, I just don't. Uh, I consider you my best friend. I can trust you. Oh, that's corny, you know. Okay. okay. Ahora cambiamos. No, yo soy Jesse. Y Ana, ah, no. Y... Ana, porque yo ya hice los dos. Con Fidelian, ¿cómo dice? Confidentiality. No sé cómo se dice de cosa. Así es, va. Confidentiality. Confidentiality. Ok. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome, my friend. Go ahead, Emma. Emma. Creo que la perdí. Is gender important? Ok. Yes. It, it is, is but... Okay, yes, it is, but um, yes, it is, but it isn't determined. You're a girl and you and you are my friend, and I never have problems with you, right? No, you don't. No, you don't. I consider you me, my best friend. I can trust uh, you. I can trust you. Oh, that's corny, you know. Okay, ahora con Raquel. Este, hey Johnny, do you have good friends? Uh -huh. Andrea, are you there? Suppose yes. So. Hello. Uh -huh. Andrea. Hola. What do you think? Ahora comienzo yo. Okay. Okay. Hi, Andrea. Do you have good friends? I do, but 
no many, maybe two or three. Why? I was just wondering, do you call me among your good friends? To be honest, I haven't considered that idea, but I suppose so. What qualities do you think are important? That's easy. Uh, honesty, sincerity, loyalty, and confident, confidentiality. Is gender important? Yes, it is, but isn't determining you are a girl and, and you are my friend and I never have a problem with you, right? No, you don't. I consider you my best friend. I can Corny. trust you. Oh, thanks, Corny. You know. Ahora... Two or three. Why? I was just wondering. Do you call my? Do you call me among? You come, friends. To be honest, I haven't considered the idea, but I suppose so. Are you there, Mauricio? What qualities I, I, do you I, think I, I, are I, I, important? Okay, okay, That's okay. easy. Honesty, no, sincerity, loyalty, and confidentiality. Ah. Is gender ah. important? Yes, it is. But it isn't determining you're a girl and you are my friend. And I never have problems with you, right? No, you don't. I consider you my best friend. I can't trust you. Oh, that's corny. Corny, you know. Okay. Nos intercambiamos ahora. Bueno, empiezo. Okay. Hey, Johnny. Do you have a girlfriend? I do, but not many. Maybe two or three. Why? I was just wondering. Do you call me among your good friends? To be honest, I have considered the idea but I suppose so. What quality do you think are import, important? Mm, that it's honesty, sincerity, loyalty, and confidentiality. Is gender important? Yes, it is. But it's easy that Germany, your girl, and you are my friend, and I never have problems with you, right? No, you don't. I consider you my my best friend. I can trust you. Oh, that's corny. Corny, you know. Okay. Marixa y su compañero ahora intercambian lugares. You are my friend. I never have problem with you, right? No, you don't. I consider you my best friend. I can trust you. Oh, that's corny. You know. Okay. Quizás hoy hagamos lo mismo, pero cambiemos el orden. Que empiece alguien. Okay, we have 14 people out. We have 14. I guess there are more people coming out. 15. All right. Supposedly we are 19. 
Okay, well, we are all there. Let's see. Pre-task, core values, core values, central values, purpose to discuss the importance of core values. Now, the ones that you see here are personal personality traits, character traits. Okay, let's see, change the color. Character traits. You may think, teacher, character traits. Yeah, character traits. Why, I mean, how can we relate company core values with a person's character? Okay, there is a relationship. For the company, one of the principles is be organized. But if you are disorganized, and your character is that you are a disorganized person, you have two options. Two options. Organize or bye-bye. Go home. Two things. Get organized or hit the road. Bye bye, Jack. Okay, so that's why the character and the, the values of the company have to be, run together. Okay, they have to run together. We say if you are a determined, you are determined, you will work hard and you continue, continue until you finish. The determination drives you. Okay. So that's why character is related to the core values of a company. Your character. Why? A company is made by people, and the people have characters. So, but the characters have to be adaptable, they have to adapt to the values of the people. But we have here positive and negative values, okay, sorry, positive and negative traits. If they are positive, they can be values. If they are negative, they can be defects. And all the people have defects. We all have defects, nobody's perfect, right? Okay, check over here. Generosity, integrity, loyalty, 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 devoted, loving, kindness, sincerity, self-control, peaceful, faithful. We have adjectives and we have nouns mixed. Patient, patience, patience, determination, persistence, open-minded. So Open-mindedness would be there, okay? Open-minded, fair, cooperative, tolerant. Teacher. Yes? What is open-minded? Open-minded. It says it. Open. Open. Mind. Oh, mente abierta? Yes. Okay, thank you. Yes, you're welcome. Some people have open minds, but the idea is not only to have open minds, to have clean minds. Clean minds, not only open. We cannot accept everything. We have to have a filter, right? It has to be a filter that says, this is good, this is not good. So we tolerate, not necessarily accept. Right? So that's why you have open-minded, 
fair, cooperative, tolerant, optimistic, spiritual. Now, the other one, dishonest, disloyal, unkind, mean, rude, disrespectful, impatient, greed, abrasive, pessimistic, cruel, unmerciful, narcissistic, obnoxious, malicious, pettiness, quarrelsome, caustic, selfish, unforgiving. We're going to see some of these, but not all of them. So, do you have questions? Sorry, teacher, I, I, I don't, I don't know uh, many, many words. For it's, example, faith, faithful, uh -huh. uh, and uh, peaceful, um, peaceful, faithful, faithful, faithful. Uh -huh. Okay. Um, let's say I'm going to give an example with your wife. You have a wife, you respect your wife. You don't go out with other women. You are faithful to your wife. Other men say, ah, you're not very intelligent. You should go with, uh, with other girls. That's not intelligent. If you go out with other women, you destroy what you have at home. So, you have to be faithful. Means respect the relationship, respect your wife, right? That is faithful. So if you are faithful, you can be faithful to your to the company. What's how can you be faithful to the company? Fiel. Fiel. Okay. Faithful to the company too. Okay. Yeah. And in in the defect, for example, I don't know what is greed. Greed. Okay. The adjective is greedy. Greedy with a Y at the end. Greedy. Um, the idea of greed is I want more, 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 more. This is for me, for me, for me, and more. Greed. Okay, it's not only with money. For example, with people, I mean, people, um, when they eat, they don't, they don't eat the normal portion. No, they eat a lot. Eat a lot and like this. They eat greedily, right? Uh, okay. Of, of no... Of nauseous, of nauseous? Uh, that is harmful, dañino, harmful. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. And pettiness? Pettiness is something that is not important. Something okay. that is petty is not important. Quarrelsome? Someone who likes to fight. Oh, okay. Okay, thank you, teacher. You're welcome, you're welcome. Okay, so these are some character traits. I will repeat them. Uh, I would recommend that you go to Google. I'm going to show you how to use it. And you can type these words. For example, why? Why am I going to teach you? Uh, because you are my students and because uh, that can help you be a little independent. You don't always have to depend on someone to tell you. Okay, so let me see. Uh, I'm going to share, I'm going to stop sharing what I'm sharing and I'm going to share what I'm not sharing. Okay, wow teacher. Check over here. You can see the screen, a lot of flowers. Okay. Now let's see, think about this. 
uh, you write translate. Okay, and you have this. And you can put Spanish to English. And here you put the text. Imagine that you could abrasive. Okay. And oh, so it's the opposite, right? You put here abrasive. Mm -hmm. And they say abrasivo or abrasiva. You say, but oh, what's that? It doesn't say anything. Okay, so what do you do with this? If you don't know the meaning, okay. Abrasive is something that breaks the skin. Que corroe la piel, right? Abrasive, abrasivo. Uh, example, bleach is abrasive. Le la lejía is abrasivo. Uh, here you have the pronunciation. You can hear. Abrasive. Abrasive. Right? Pronunciation. Translation, pronunciation. And then uh, you can have more. Okay, but they don't have examples. You look for examples. Okay, so you can go to another page and look for examples. Okay, or pictures, videos, and then you have the word more clear. So uh, another example, let me see. Another example that you can have is like, imagine that you have caustic. Caustic is very sharp, a very sharp remark. But imagine that you write caustic. And here they tell you caustic. You say, teacher, what's caustic? It's a substance that, it, that makes you cry because it's very strong. Una sustancia que lo hace llorar porque es muy fuerte. Okay, caustic. Pero también es decir, sharp, duro, sin, sin corazón. Una, un comentario duro, a caustic remark, can offend people, right? Caustic remark. So, biting, acrid, uh, vitriolic, scathing, that would be the translation. <laughs> Okay, and you have the pronunciation. Caustic. Right, pronunciation, caustic. Okay, so this is an idea for you to practice. And you can look for examples, okay? And you work, that works for you. Okay, let me stop sharing when I'm sharing and let me share what I was sharing. Okay, let's move on. We have these questions. Which of these character traits can be, be core values? Teacher, I don't understand. Okay, the question is, which of the, the, the ones in the list, the, the ones that refer to the character can be core company or company core values? Which? Honesty, sincerity, right? Determination, all of these can be core values. So which values can be anti-values? Which values can be anti-values? An example. Cruel. Hmm? Cruel. Yeah, only cruel is not um, a value, right? So, but think about a value. It's an anti-value. Uh -huh. Yes, that's, but which of these can be an anti-value? For example. Uh, yes, honesty. The, all of these are anti-values, all of these. 
but for each of these can be an antibody. For example, sincerity. Sincerity can be an antibody. No, teacher. No, teacher. Okay. Yes. You come and you are very sincere. You tell your friends, hey, you look very fat in that dress. Okay, that's what you think. And you say it. You're very sincere. Hey, you look very fat in that dress. Okay. How does the girl feel? You are sincere. Bad. But you feel you offend the person. Nobody asked you. Number one, nobody asked. You. Number two, it's none of your business. Teacher, what is none of your business? Not importa. None of your business. Si la chica es gordita o no es gordita, no es tu problema. Okay. And she didn't ask you, hey, am I fat? No, right? Hey, you look fat in that dress. It's sincerity, but it is what? An anti value. Why? Number one, we should respect people. If we don't think something good, don't say it. Right? Right. Anti value. Okay, what is another anti value in the company? Generosity. What is a company? What's a company? A business. And if people come and you say, ah, here you have one, two, three products. Okay, bye bye. Every time that the people come here, you have, here you have, here you have, you are generous. What happens to the company? So generosity can be an anti value too. Right? You can be generous with your things, not with the company's things. Yes? So that is what I'm talking about. I don't know if you see the relationship. Good things can be bad. Yes? So we have to keep a balance. Okay, so that's the idea. So which values can be anti-values and why? So generosity, sincerity can be. Another thing is that you work too hard. You work too hard. That is what? An anti-value in your family. You are all the time in the company. And your family. So that is an also another thing. Okay, so when should we leave the core values? Why? So these are the questions. Will our bosses be happy if we leave our core, va core values? Will outsiders, people de fuera de la compañía, will outsiders see our core values and like our company? So discuss these questions. Okay, after the attendance, after the attendance, first the attendance. Okay. Let's see. Abigail Mejia. Excellent. Eh, Ana Maria Portillo. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Andrea Amalia Garcia. Andrea Maria Cruz. Present teacher. Excellent. Dilcia 
Yamile Fernández. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Emma Gloria Martínez. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Esmeralda del Carmen Ayala. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Gabriela Beatriz Moreno. Present. Excellent, good. Jorge Antonio Sánchez. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Ex José Ezequiel Guzmán. Bueno, eh, yo lo vi en el grupo, así que lo voy a poner presente. Juan José Herrera. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Kenia Elizabeth Rodríguez. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Lady Xiomara Chicas. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Maritza Yanira Hernández. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Paola Stef Stephanie Mejía. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Raquel Abigail García. Present. Excellent, nice. Raquel Beatriz Segura. Rebeca Guadalupe Aguillón. Present. Excellent, good. Sandra Patricia Ramos. Stephanie Michelle Oviedo. Present, teacher. Excellent. I haven't seen you, Michelle. Okay. Let's see. Excuse wow. me? I seen you. No la había visto. Yes, recién entro. Ah, ok. Eh, Guadalupe del Carmen Silva. Ok. Mauricio Antonio Velázquez. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Jonathan Alexis Alfaro. Yo vi a Jonathan. Lo vamos a poner presente. Ok. So, let's continue. Let's see. So, we're going to discuss the question. Discuss, give your opinions about this question. Groups are opening. Andrea García, Andrea Amalia García, you're in group one. Andrea Amalia, los grupos también son importantes. Ahí es donde practicamos. Por favor, unas. Creo que los primeros tres aplican. Ajá. La segunda diría qué valores Which pueden ser is... antivalores. ¿Por qué? La número tres. Cuando debemos vivir, debemos vivir los valores fundamentales. ¿Por qué? El número cuatro. ¿Serán, ¿Serán felices nuestros jefes si vivimos los valores fundamentales? Will our bosses be happy if we live the core values? Uh -huh. Serán los Y vamos. Yes. Nuestro valor fundamental les gustará a nuestra empresa. Let's see our core values. I like our company. Yes. 
Um, <laughs> which value can be the anti -value, values? Why? Eso es lo que explicaba el teacher. Values, sí. values. Values. Que, un, que lo, algunos de estos podrían convertirse en antivalores si los sí. usamos mal. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Son And valores. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh, Pash. Paciencia. Patient. Uh, es que no sé cómo decir. <laughs> <laughs> When the other co-worker asks me everything and I patient with him, and I have to explain and I have to do my work. It's a problem. Por tenerle mucha paciencia me va a poner también la carga de trabajo. Y tendría que ser mi trabajo y el trabajo de esa persona por estarle explicando. Sí, uh -huh. es cierto. Es una buena aplicación, exacto. De... La otra. La otra dice. Persistence. Uh -huh. Ah, la otra pregunta. Antivaluos. Antivaluos. Values. 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 ¿Qué valores son antivalores y por qué? Uh, cruel. cruel, selfish, selfish, disloyal, disloyal, dishonest, Dishonest. narcissist, malicious, los, los, malicious, los, los últimos. Mm. ¿Por qué? Why? Malicious, no piensen que es malicioso como nosotros lo creemos. Que nosotros decimos, ay, qué maliciosa, solo se anda peinando. Se... ¿No? Malicious es malintencionado. Uh -huh. Ajá. Malicious es malintencionado. Malicious. Va con maldad. O sea, cuando alguien hace algo por dañar a otro, con el, con el deseo de dañar a otro, eso es malicious. Teacher, tenía una duda también. Con el, en la tarea 4, habla como de eso, de los valores. Pero no entendí como qué es lo que quiere que se ponga. Algunos estuvieron escribiéndome. Lamentablemente, después de la medianoche, yo ya estoy en el, los sueños, entonces ya no pude contestar. Pero algunos me preguntaban, ¿y lo que sucedía? Es que allí decía, si actúas con lealtad, ¿cómo eres? Tenía que poner. Ah. Bueno, if you act with loyalty, how are you? Or what's your characteristic? You are loyal. Pero no importa que salga todo en rojito. No, si le sale en rojito, que está mal. ¿Cómo? Entonces, eh, importa porque... Nosotros queremos que usted tenga buenas notas. Si tiene buenas notas, va a pasar. Si no, pues no. Entonces, por eso es importante que así salga en, en verde. Ahora, pero, bueno, eh, allí lo, en algunas era bien, bien sencillo, era bien obvio en el sentido de que eh, si usted eh, actuaba con puntualidad, usted era puntual. Mm. Estaban haciendo un con, eh, para ver si usted entendía la diferencia entre el sustantivo y el, y el adjetivo. El sustantivo es 
puntual, o sea, digamos, puntualidad. Puntualidad es el sustantivo. Puntual es el adjetivo. Le dice, actúa con puntualidad. Es. Eres puntual. puntual. Ah, if you act with punctuality, you are. Y, y si dice, if you are a leader, you show. Leadership. Leadership. Ajá, y puede ser leadership, pero no necesariamente. Es de irlos probando los que hemos visto para ver cuál pega ahí o, o cuál han puesto en la plataforma. Porque no es, no es que solamente ese sea el correcto, sino puede ser que el que eligieron ellos fue ese. No necesariamente es el único. Ahí es donde tienen que estar pum, 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 probando. ¿verdad? La sí. Y la plataforma no es de clavarse. Perdón por la palabra, pero no, no es de clavarse. Si alguna, eh, alguna cosa no le sale, pruebe otra, pruebe otra forma. Y si bueno, después no le salió, tal vez en el momen, momentito no andamos muy bien concentrados, porque andamos cansados, principalmente después de clase, es normal. ¿no? Entonces haga lo que pueda y al día siguiente haga lo demás. Tal vez está un poco más fresco el día siguiente y puede hacerlo un poco mejor, pero no se dé por vencido. ¿Okay? Si lo dejó esta vez con 80%, hágalo mañana y lo deja con el 100%. Hoy, esa es la idea. Y como no son muchas preguntas, son poquitas, para que lo pueda ir haciendo bien. ¿Okay? Y si no me he dormido, si es, y si no estoy trabajando, Todavía me puede escribir y yo voy a ver el teléfono y le voy a contestar. Hoy. Es ok. Gracias. Porque, porque no es que sea malo que no le contesta. A veces estoy ocupado trabajando y no puedo, no puedo ver el teléfono en ese momento. Por ejemplo, ahorita me están escribiendo otros y ya vi que ahí están como 34 mensajes, pero no los puedo contestar porque estoy con ustedes. <risa> Sí, no, no, les tiene que contestar ahorita. Ah, mentira. Sí, cabal, no puedo ahorita. Ok. We finish, right? Yeah. Ok, let's go to the, to the main group. Okay. Let's go to the main group. So... Okay. Task preparation. Task preparation. Crossword. Teacher, crossword. Cross es cruz. Word. Palabras que van para abajo, palabras que van para abajo, vertical y para a través. Across and uh, down. Down and across. Como crucigrama. Crucigrama. Sí, cruz. Y grama, tal vez la gramática, no sé. Ok, pero es el, la palabra, cr crossword. Crossword puzzle, crucigrama. Uh -huh. Ok. Let's read them. Being faithful to your friends, family, or to your principles. Number two, the belief that something or someone should not be harmed or treated rudely. Teacher, belief, creencia. Something should not be harmed. Harmed, dañado. No debe ser lastimado o tratado eh, descortésmente. Okay. Three, 
doing something well and effectively without wasting time, money, or energy. Haciendo algo bien efectivamente sin gastar o sin desperdiciar tiempo, dinero y energía. What is that? Y si y si efficiency. Okay. The introduction of new ideas, methods, or inventions. Being honest and fair and behaving accordingly, according to the moral principles that you believe in. Across. Being good at leading groups or leading a group, organization, country, okay, the world, etc. The quality of being dependable. The ability to understand how someone feels because you can imagine what it is like to be them. Arriving or being done exactly at the time, at exactly the time that has been arranged. Arranged means planeado, organizado, o eh, que se, ha, se han puesto de acuerdo para hacerlo en ese horario. The quality of being fair and truthful. Okay, justo y equitativo en ese caso. Truthful es eh, verdadero, honesto. Okay, so like this. Okay, these are the things. My friends, you need to complete this. Down, across, down and across. Down by the river. So you're going to go to the groups and work with your partner, okay? Let's complete that. Here we go, the groups are opening. Let's join. Ana María por ti. No sé si pueden ver la pantalla. Bárbaro. Yes. <laughs> ok. Being faithful to your friends, family, principles, etc. Make fun. Then. Um, loyalty. Siete loyalty. Loyalty. Mm -hmm. Empieza con L. Digo que es él. <risas> sí, esa tiene que ser. Loyalty. No. Solo que con este PDF no creo poder escribir. Oh. 
en las herramientas. ¿Sí? En herramientas. Rellenar y firmar. Puede ser que aquí, ¿verdad? Thanks. Ajá. Y una letrita a la vez. <ríe> Cabal. Sí. Okay. Thank you, teacher. No había revisado esto en este PDF. <laughs> You're welcome. Okay. Loyalty. Algo no puede ser tratado. Tratado. Algo, la, la creencia de que algo no puede ser tratado. Generos, no, género, no ser creo que generos, o... generosity. Esta es la doble para abajo. No, no cabe. Son una, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis. Son siete letras. Mm. Dos, cuatro, cinco, Entonces la primera, ¿cómo le pusieron? Loyal. Loyal. La cuatro. Yo digo la cuatro. La cuatro ah, para la horizontal. Being a good or leading a good organization. Good at leading. Um, Innovation. 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 No, 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 sí, sí, no, 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 Um, uh, number six. Six. Number six. The quality of being dependable. Debe ser confiable la cualidad. Vamos a ver. Honestly. Vamos a ver. La, la quinta letra tendría que ser una O. Oh, ah, pues no. Pero no. es súper larga. Yes. Mm, mm, mm. Vamos a ver. Responsabilidad. Responsabilidad. No me responde. Oh, sí, que es. Thanks. Sabi. Uh -huh. Vamos a ver. Res. <risa> me gusta la R. <risa> <risa> Res. <risa> Creo que es muy corta. Con No, justa. Sí, esa es. <risa> B. Sí, How es please. Eh, aquí, B. Li. Li. L. L. I. 
I, I T, T, Y. ¡Bravo! Uh -huh. Voy a arreglar el nombre. Este que me quedó coqueta. Ahí está. <risa> me gustan estos jeroglíficos. Sería el número 8, ¿verdad? Yes. Así es. The ability to understand how someone feels because you can imagine what is it like to be them. To be them. Ajá. La habilidad de entender cómo se siente, se siente, alguien. siente alguien. Porque Ajá, tú empático. imaginas. Ajá. Uh -huh. Empathy. Empathy. Ah, ok. Ah, yes. Empathy. Sí, sí. Empathy. T. T. H. Y. E H H Ah, sí. Empathy. Oh, okay. Ya. Yeah. Bravo. Yes, empathy. Okay. Uh, la número 10. Okay. Ah, yes. The quality of being fair and truthful. Truthful. The quality of being fair and truthful. La cualidad debe de ser Justa y la otra justa y verás. Vamos a ver. Uy, a ver ah. si. Que... ¿Cuál, ¿Cuál es esa, compañeros? El ten. Oh, ten. Ten. Ajá, the quality uh -huh. of being fair. Debe and... ser uh -huh. justa y verás. Ajá. Uh -huh. Termina en chong. Uh -huh. Chong. chong. ¿El qué? Yo. Yeah. I don't know. Chum. Determination. No. No. No, no, me fui muy. Um, Honestidad, no. Honesty, no. Honesty. 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 Why? Why? Yeah. Why? Eh. Honesty. Okay. The the night. The night. It says. Ponlo. Pon el el cuadrito. Vamos a ver. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez. Son diez. Y, eh, y efectivo no, no sería es efectivo de dinero es efectivo no creo que sea es efectivo eh Esperen, que ya perdí donde estaba. Ocho. Eh, sí. ¿Y eficiencia? Mm. Un, dos, tres, cuatro. Tiene 10. Eureka. 2, 
Teacher, no comprendimos esta parte. ¿Mm? No logramos comprender esta parte. ¿Cuál parte? Eh, lo del crucigrama. ¿Alguna vez completó crucigrama en español? Sí. Yo no, soy mala para eso, teacher. Es el... Jamás completé ninguno. Sí. Ni en español ni en novela. Es el mismo procedimiento. Ya fría, ya, ya, no, ya no vamos a salir del grupo y va a haber los compañeros que terminaron. Sí. Ok. Esto en los down, usted busca la palabra que quepa en el, en el número de cuadritos, que va para abajo, el uno va para abajo, el cuatro va a través, el seis va a través, el ocho también, el nueve y el diez, el dos van hacia abajo, el tres, cinco y siete van hacia abajo. Y tienen que compaginar de la forma correcta. Ok, pero en este caso, ¿cuál, cuál palabra de, de, por lo menos la uno? ¿Qué palabra tomaríamos? Your friends, family and principles. Loyalty. Empieza con L para abajo. Loyalty. Lealtad, loyal. Teacher, muy poquito tiempo. ¿No terminaron? No. no, teacher. Ok, no problem. En su casita sigan practicando. Les vamos a echar una manito. Ok. Ya van a salir los demás. We're seven out. Seven people are out. Eight. We're waiting for the others. Eight people. Okay. Eighteen. Now everybody's out. Okay. Michelle, did you finish? Microphone. Sorry, teacher. Yeah. Uh, I don't know how do you say Cassie. <laughs> almost. Almost. Almost, teacher. Almost. Which the number one? three be difficult. This one. Yes. Let me see. Three. Doing something well and effective without wasting time, money, and energy. That is efficiency. Efficiency. E. F F I E N C what I think no veamos e huh? put the letters maybe yes maybe no e in red okay probemos let's try Veamos si es efficiency o effectiveness. Y.
efficiency, right? If it's yes. Okay. Um, number one, we said it was loyalty, right? Loyal, number one. Number four, we said it was? Leadership. Leadership, right? Uh -huh. And uh, number six, it was responsibility, right? Oh, so. And number eight was? The ability to understand how someone feels because empathy. Empathy. And number nine. Punctuality. Punctuality, right? And number 10, the quality of being fair and trustful and truthful. Which one did you put? Honesty? No. GF teacher. Honesty. Veamos. Number five. Innovation. Innovation, okay. Mm -hmm. Num number two. What is number two? Respect. Excellent. And the last one, seven. 
being honest and fair and behaving according to the moral principles you believe in. In Integrity. Okay. All right. Congratulations to the ones who finished. And uh, the ones who didn't finish, maybe not today, next time. Okay. No problem. Nobody dies. Nadie se murió. Don't worry. <laughs> no problem. Okay, let's continue. Correct four mistakes related to infinitives. Four mistakes. Four mistakes. Four mistakes related to. We have the company's mission is to distributing top quality office. What do we say? Without two. To distribute, right? Okay. To distribute, excellent. Our vision is to become the leaders in the communications sector. Telecommunications sector. Sector. Is. 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 To become the leaders in the telecommunications sector. Number three, we exist for to providing integrated logistic services. Erase four. Erase four. Uh -huh. Our goal is be recognized as the number one dairy producer. Two. Exactly. Rex ambitions to becoming the number one manufacturer of clothes for kids. To become. To become. Okay. Four mistakes. The thing is that number two is not a mistake of infinitives. Infinitive, 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 infinity. This, no. This is ac an accident. This is an accident, the other side intentional. Okay. Let's see. Conversation. Conversation. This is a conversation between Juan and Sonia. And they are talking about the immortality of the crab. No, the immortality of the crab, no. They are talking about core values. Hey, Sonia, do you know the core values of our company? Do we have core values? I didn't know. I suppose every company has them. Vilma, do you know them? Yes, I do. They are respect, solidarity, discipline, efficiency, honesty, and cooperation. Excellent. You know them well. Yes, but do you know how to apply them? Uh, what do you mean? They aren't just theory. You must live them. I guess I don't follow you. While you're working, you must respect others show empathy to others, and so on. Oh, I understand. 
Thanks for illustrating it. My pleasure. My pleasure. I guess I don't follow you means, I guess is creo. Creo que no te entiendo. I guess I don't follow you. I guess I don't follow, follow you. Yes, I don't follow you. Okay. So, hey, Sonia, do you know the core values of our company? Do we have core values? I didn't know. I suppose every company has them. Vilma, do you know them? Yes, I do. They are respect, solidarity, discipline, efficiency, honesty, co and cooperation. Excellent. You know them well. Yes, but do you know how to apply them? What do you mean? They aren't just theory. You must live them. I guess I don't follow you. While you're working, you must respect others, show empathy to others, and so on. Oh, I understand. Thanks for illustrating it. My pleasure. Okay, let's go to practice the conversation. You're going to have five minutes. So, let's see. Okay, let's join the groups. Tercera involucrada, ¿verdad? O sea, son tres, pero Sonia solo tiene una línea. Oh. Ok, yo Juan, voy a ser Juan. <ríe> okay. <ríe> ok. Sonia puede ser Vilma. Juan es Juan y Vilma, pues, Sonia puede ser Vilma. Okay. Okay. Hey, Sonia, do you know the core values of our company? Do we have core values? I didn't know. I suppose every company has them. Vilma, do you know them? Yes, I do. They are respect, solidarity, discipline, Efficiency, honesty, and cooperation. Excellent. You know them well. Yes, but do you know how to apply them? What do you mean? They aren't just theory. You must like them. I guess I don't follow you. Show empathy to others in so um empathy. Oh, I understand. Empath. understand. Empath. Oh, I understand. Thank you for illustrating it. My pleasure. My pleasure. Pleasure. My pleasure. Hey, Sonia. Do you know the core values of oh, of our company? Values. 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 de bueno, ni osito, ¿no? Que el osote que sale en el, con Mowgli en el libro de la selva. Es Balú. Es un value. 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 You. Diga you. you. Como, la, como la pastilla Valium. Valium. Ok. Value. Values. Values. Eh, Do we like them? 
What do you mean? They aren't just theory. You must leave them. I guess I don't call on you. Why? You're working. You must respect others, show empathy to others, and so on. Oh, I understand. Thank you for illustrating it. Illustrating it. My pleasure. Vaya. Eh. Este, ahora empezaría yo. Hey, Sonia, do you know the core values of our company? Do we have core values? I didn't know. I suppose every company has them. Vilma, do you know them? Yes, I do. They are respect, solidarity, discipline, affection, honesty, and cooperation. Excellent. Do you know them well? Yes, but do you know? A ver, ¿cuál otro tenía? No, no, continúe. Ok. Mauricio y Andrea. Eh, intercambiamos el ¿Ah? Ajá. Los intercambiamos los roles. Ok. Andrea. Mm. Hello. Comienzo. Eh, no, yo I voy a comenzar. Hey, hey Sanjay, do you know the core values of our company? Do we have a core value I didn't know? I suppose I suppose every company has them. Vilma, do you know them? Yes, I do. They are a respect, solidarity, discipline, efficient, honesty, uh, cooperation. Excellent. You know them well? Yes, but working, you must respect others, show empathy. To other and so on. Oh, I understand. Thanks for illustration. It. My pleasure. Okay. Okay. Hola. Mm -hmm. Hola. <laughs> Ok, ahí terminó, vea. Volvemos a, vuelve otra vez Marisa y Jonathan a repetirlo. Ok, ahí está. Por si teníamos tiempo, íbamos a practicar esto. Ok. Tenemos unos minutos. Let's practice. Ok. Listen to your teacher read the conversation. Then practice with a the partner. Hi, Roxana. Welcome to Rex. Esta ya la practicamos en una clase anterior. Ok. Es repetición. Uh, hi, Roxana. Welcome to Rex. My name is Jessica. I'm the industrial safety engineer. Thanks, Jessica. Nice to meet you. My department is responsible for keeping the safety of the plant. I see. I see means I understand. I see. I'll be part of the maintenance department. Will I be responsible to you? Great. Our departments work together, but the maintenance chief 
is in charge of directing your department. You'll be responsible to him. Thank you, Jessica. May I call you if I need your help? Sure, sure, okay. So, hi, Roxana, welcome to Rex. My name's Jessica. I'm the industrial safety engineer. Thanks, Jessica, nice to meet you. My department is responsible for keeping the safety of the plant. I see, I'll be part of the maintenance department. Will I be responsible to you? Great, our departments work together, but the maintenance chief is in charge of directing your department. You'll be responsible to him. Thank you, Jessica. May I call you if I need it? If I need help? Sure. Okay, let's go to, to practice. Okay, let's go to practice. This is the last thing. Last, last, last. Last, last, last. Let's go and practice. Sorry. ¿Cómo? ¿Quién empieza? Ok, soy Jessica. Hi, Roxana. Welcome to Rex. My name is Jessica. I am the industrial safety engineer. Thanks, Jessica. Nice to meet you. My department is responsible for keeping the safety of the plant. I see. I'll be part of the maintenance department. Will I be responsible to you? Great. Our department work together, but the maintenance chief is in charge of directing you department. You will be responsible to him. Thank you, Jessica. May I call you if I need help? Sure. Okay. Ahora soy Jessica. Hi, Roxana. Welcome to the Rex. My name is Jessica. I am, I am the industrial safety engineer. Um, Tom, Jessica, nice to meet you. My department is responsible for keep keeping the safety of the plant. Safety, safety, the safety of the plant. Safety, safe. Come on, pardon. Safety. Safety. Safety of the plan. Okay. Uh, Roxana. Uh, ¿Dónde iba? Uh, that... I see. No, I, I see. see. I, I see. I be part of the maintenance. Departments will be responsible to you. Great. Our department. Vaya. Eh, Michelle, ahora si quieres empiezo y tú continúas. Ok. Hi, Roxana. Welcome to Rex. My name is Jessica. I am the industrial safety engineer. Thanks, Jessica. Nice to meet you. My department is responsible for keeping the safety of the plant. I see. I'll be the part I be part of the maintenance department. Will I be responsible to you? Great. 
Our departments work together, but the maintenance chief is in charge of directing your department. You'll be responsible to him. Thank you, Jessica. May I call you? It's it. I need help. Sure. Ahora tu con Emma. Okay. Bye, Emma. Hey. Hi, Roxana. Welcome to Rex. My name is Jessica. I am the industrial self self safety engineer. Thank you, Jessica. May I help you if I need help? Sure. Okay. Jorge. Okay, I start. Yes. Hi, Roxana. Welcome to Rex. My name is Jessica. I'm the industrial safety engineer. Thanks, Jessica. Nice to meet you. My department is responsible for keeping the safety on the plant. I see. I will part of the maintenance department. Will I be responsible to you? Great. All department work together. But the maintenance chief is a chair of directing your department. You'll be responsible to him. Thank you, Jessica. May I call you if you need a help? Sure. Time for the attendance, let's see. Abigail Mejia Mendoza. Present. Hola. Ana Maria Portillo. Present teacher. Excellent. Eh, Andrea Amalia Garcia. Present. Present, okay. No la vi en los grupos. Okay. And ¿Cómo no? Sí estuve. Sí estuvo, ¿verdad? Pues no, yo no me fijé. Andrea María Cruz. Presente, teacher. Excelente. Tilcia Yamilés Hernández. Presente, teacher. Excelente. Hoy se queda conmigo. Ok, por favor. Emma Gloria Martínez. Present Excellent. Esmeralda del Carmen Ayala. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Gabriela Vera. Present. Excellent. Good. Jorge Antonio Sanchez. Present teacher. Very good. Nice. Ese Jose Ezequiel Guzmán. Creo que escribió que se le fue limpio. Ah, ok. José, Juan José Herrera. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Kenya Elizabeth Rodríguez. Present, teacher. Excellent, very good. Lady Xiomara Chicas. Present, teacher. Ok, very good. Maritza Yanir Hernández. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Paola Stephanie Mejía. Present, teacher. Great, very good. Raquel Abigail García. Ok, Raquel Beatriz Segura. Teacher present. Raquel García. Raquel García, ok. ¿Usted estuvo en, en los grupos? Sí, teacher. Ok. Es que me fijé que algunos no entraban. Ok. Rebeca Guadalupe Aguillón. Present. 
Excellent, nice. Sandra Patricia Ramos. Stephanie Michelle Oviedo. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Guadalupe del Carmen Silva. Okay. No Silva. Okay. Mauricio Antonio Vázquez. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Jonathan Alexis Alfaro. Present. Excellent, okay. Eh, normalmente los minutos que usted está dentro de los grupos son contados. O sea, se incluyen en la asistencia y los grupos y los minutos que no entra quedan como que no, no estuvo esos minutos, como que usted estuvo ausente esos minutos. Y si solamente contamos solo lo que estuvimos fuera, digamos que estuvimos una hora fuera y una hora en los grupos y no, no entró a los grupos, se quedó solo con una hora de asistencia. Okay, entonces, dice, bueno, teacher, yo no sabía. Bueno, no hay problema. Para la próxima vez. Paola. Teacher, si digamos, cuando justo nos llama, acabamos de salir, igual hay problema. Perdón. Que si digamos, cuando ya va a cerrar los grupos, este, cuando salimos, ahí no hay problema si salimos como antes. Eh, o sea, no esperar hasta que se termine el tiempo, pues, a eso me refería. Lo mejor es salir juntos, o sea, cuando se da la llamada de, de terminado el grupo, entonces salir. Así todo el tiempo se le cuenta como, como que estuvo dentro. ¿verdad? Si se sale antes, pareciera que se cortó, se le cortó la llamada o cualquier cosa, entonces quedó fuera mientras todo está dentro. Ajá. Ok, thank you. Entonces, Teacher, este, ¿sí? dígame. Y si fuera el caso que vaya, nos aparece el mensaje que quedan, por decirlo, 60 segundos sí. y esperamos hasta que se finalicen los 60 segundos, ahí no hay problema. No, no hay problema. No. Ok. No hay problema. Ok, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for attending today. Have a nice weekend. Para mañana, todos los... Todos los las tareas de todos los días deben estar completas para antes de las 8 de la mañana. Así que, por favor, eh, háganme la caridad. ¿okay? Completen eso. Porque el reporte se va a ir tipo 8 y un poquito se va. Tipo 8 y 10, 8 y cuarto se lo llevan. Entonces... A las 8 ya tiene que estar completo eso. Entonces, si hoy en la noche no lo quieren hacer porque le tienen sueñito ya, yo los entiendo. Están cansados y merecen descansar. Pero eso se tiene que ir. Entonces, si se quieren levantar a las 5 de la mañana y completarlo, perfecto. O si quieren levantar a las 4 de la mañana y hacer todo lo que les falta, pues bienvenido, no hay problema. Pero antes de las 8. Después de las 8 ya se va a haber ido el reporte. Aunque eso no quiere decir que ustedes no puedan adelantar. Pueden ir adelantando todo lo que ustedes quieran. Y lo, si algo les quedó de la semana anterior, pueden hacerlo la siguiente, no hay problema. La idea es llevar todo completo lo mejor posible. Por supuesto, en el reporte tiene que ir lo de la semana, ¿verdad? Y si vamos una semana limpia, bonito. Si no, pues, si no, ¿qué puede hacer? No vamos a llorar por eso. <risa> ok, y si está muy cansadito, pues ya le quiero. Ok, ladies and gentlemen, have a nice weekend. See you on Monday. Ok, bye bye. Take bye. Care. Good night. Good, good night. night. Good night. Take care. Be good. Good, good night. Weekend. Good night. Take care. Have a nice weekend.
who is responsible for keeping the safety of the personnel in the plant? Who is in charge of directing the maintenance personnel? Who is Roxana responsible to? Look at the organizational chart above. Who are the safety engineer and the maintenance chief responsible to? This is the structure of the REX company. General manager, auditor, quality control inspector, floor manager, financial department, computer department, sales department, safety engineer, supervisor, machine operators, and assemblers, maintenance chief, maintenance personnel, and truck drivers. Complete the chart. Who is responsible for supervising the machine operators? Supervising. Who is responsible for supervising the machine operators? Who is in charge of checking the quality of the products? Who is responsible for repairing? Who is responsible for repairing the problems of the machines? We say for repairing the machines. Queremos que los problemas estén arruinados. No queremos reparar los problemas. Queremos reparar las máquinas. Entonces no reparamos los problemas. Who is responsible for repairing the machine? Who is accountable for selling the products? Who is in charge of assisting the assemblers? Who is accountable for managing the whole operation? Now, this is the last thing that you have to do. Create a basic organizational chart about your company. Describe how you and your department relate to the other departments. Discuss your responsibilities and who you report to. And uh, go around the classroom explaining your organizational chart to two, class, to two partners. Be ready to answer your partner's questions. Okay, so time uh, finished before we could actually do that. So we're going to stop here, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for attending tonight. Good night. See you. Have a nice weekend.